Hey guys, video info 101. I'm very, very sorry. This is another direct upload. I had company over today and I didn't have time to make another video. So I didn't have time to edit a video. So I'm, I wanted to get one up there though. So this is my setup. I'm pretty excited about this actually. Um, what I'm disappointed about is my Asin SMX10 today, came today. I did an unboxing video, but right in the middle of it, like, not exactly the middle, but close to the middle of it, my microphone just faded away, and the battery died. Oh my gosh, like, you can't redo an unboxing video. So, I was so, I was pretty mad about that, because I was editing that, and it was almost done, and then I realized that. <laughs> I should have realized that before, but I didn't. And, so, this is what I'm going to show you, direct upload, sorry, I'll make some edited videos, good quality videos tomorrow. But, um... What it, there's the SMX. Sorry, it's gonna be, but without the windscreen and then with the windscreen, comes off really easy. I'll do a review on that tomorrow. But um, uh, one sec. I'm gonna unplug this. Um, so what it is is a. I'll plug it back in one sec. Hold up. Oh crap. I I just took it out of the shock mount. So I just took it out of the shock mount so I could um explain to you guys what this shock how I made the shock mount. I'll do it if you want me to do a tutorial on the shock mount, it's a really good shock mount. It's really versatile. Like I can use it on my boom pole. Like I will explain. I'll do a boom pole video. I don't know. I'll I'll do a bunch of videos on this kind of stuff because the shock mount didn't cost me anything because I just found PVC in a bolt and some rubber bands. Alright, so what it is, I I cut this piece of PVC, put it a put a hole in there, threaded a bolt through, then cut notches all around, put a bunch of rubber bands in, taped it. So the um, you want to put the bolt in before you put the rubber bands in or else you're going to be all doing weird stuff. So um, uh, you th uh, what I did is I threaded this, I put it through, see how the angle, the angle bracket has two holes? Well the top hole is covered by duct tape, but I just, you can, since the, it's only duct tape, I um, fell around and I felt felt the hole and I poked a hole through it just with like uh, something sharp. I think it was like a screwdriver or something. But um, I poked a hole through. Then I uh, just put this through and then put a wing nut in there. If you want to know how to make this pop filter, just go to my other video. I'm sorry I'm in a rush because it's really late and I have to upload this though. But um, how I put this, since I have a um, S... HFS 200. I um can't uh I can't um put a cold shoe in so otherwise I wouldn't I probably wouldn't do this. I would just use the shock mount that came with it. So what I did is I'll put it in the description in an in an annotation at the end. Um, it's MM Studios. He um, made a video tutorial showing how to um put a how to grind down the bolt and put it in your hot shoe on your Vixia, can of Vixia, so you can um, thread a road mic onto it. But I don't have a road mic or threads on any of my shock, the shock mount that came with the Asden mic. So what I decided to do is make that and then put, put the shock mount onto this pop filter and then put the mic through here and then in this bolt, put the bolt that's coming out of the hot shoe up here. So like, so this goes in the bolt that is out of my hot shoe. You'll understand what I'm saying if you go watch MM Studios video after this. But so like that on there, and then you get another wing nut, and then you just push, the, um, tighten that down on top of it, and that's all you'd have to do. This is uh, if you want to know how to make this. Tell me. I probably already said that. Yeah, I think I did. But it's really good. So, just leave it in the comments. I have to go. Thanks, guys, for watching. Please subscribe and watch my other videos. And the link to how to make this pop filter for only $1 is also in the description. Alright, so if you want to learn how to make this pop filter, let me zoom in. If you want to learn how to make the pop filter, click the pop filter. And if you want to learn how to make, um, 
if you want to learn how to make um, the mic holder for a Vixia series camera, um, click on the mic. So the MM Studios pop filter. Okay, guys. Bye.